Many more fans last night, Ooh. and it was loud when Alex came to the plate, and I think it's something he's going to have to get used to or tune out. Uh, this goes back, as I mentioned last night, to his admitted use of uh, steroids when he was with the Texas Rangers. Takes a pitch in there for a call strike. Tonight he has walked twice, so he has yet to have an official at bat. Well, between him and A.J. last night, they were booing A.J. Burnett. Blue Jay fans not happy that he got out of his contract from the Blue Jays. And here now with the Yanks. That's inside for a ball. We mentioned that A-Rod has uh, 31 home runs in this building. And in fact, one of them uh, was an historic home run. 450th home run, and it was actually uh, his 2,000th hit as well. It's a nice milestone. Taking care of two big numbers. His ball is fouled off to the right. Millar's coming over, and this one is out of play. Let's take a look back, and there it goes. Home run number 450, July 21st, 2006, and hit number 2,000 for Alex Rodriguez. And it was off A.J. Yeah. Burnett. All in one. Look at that. What a day. Ball of two strikes on a run. Just missed the inside corner. And it's two and two. Did you see those guys sit behind home plate? Right in the front row. Maybe we can see them on the replay here. Looks like there's more than no one umpire behind the home plate area there. Right. <laughs> there's the count, two and two. <laughs> Where are they? Oh, there they're they are. Okay. Hey, right. Oh, <laughs> hit him really <laughs> oh, Look at that. That's funny. He's got the mask on. Nothing's going to happen to him. That pitch went right back <laughs> and hit the screen. Fans of umpires. Let's What's take another look. <laughs> <laughs> Uh, you gotta have fun when you come to the ballpark. Two balls and two strikes on Alex Rodriguez. Bouncing ball foul. The count remains at two and two. The Yankees have scored another run here in the fourth inning. Johnny Damon with a leadoff double was moved to third on a ground ball by Nick Swisher and scored on a sacrifice fly by Mark Teixeira. And the Yankees lead six to one here in the fourth. Strike three, and that'll do it for the Yankees here in the fourth. But they pick up another run as Alex gets called out on strikes by multiple umpires as he swings and misses. At the end of three and a half, it's the Yankees six. <laughs> yes, he's out. The six-one Yankees. <laughs> another runner perched at third. Yankees have three triples in this game and four doubles and toss in Gardner's home run. Swing and a miss and Pena strikes out. That'll allow the Blue Jay infielders to drop back with two outs. So Murphy, three quick pitches, strikes out Pena. Murphy with the big curveball. Pena not able to lay off that pitch. Starts about neck high, ends up in the dirt. Sees it out front. Good pitch. And that'll leave it up to the catcher, Francisco. See left handed pitchers throw to left handed batters, change ups. Why? The fact, for one, there's a little window that you could actually get a strike, but it goes down and in. Johnny slashes one foul, spoils a breaking ball, and the count holds it two and two. Which is usually the left-handed sweet spot, the down and in spot. It doesn't make sense if you if you're if you're change a pitcher to throw it to a left-handed batter or right-handed. Yankees scored five in the second, one in the fourth, and two more here in the fifth. Runner goes, the pitch is in the dirt. Savelli moves down to second, but Johnny Damon has struck out and is tagged out on the play. 
Well, the Yankees come up with two more runs on three hits here in the fifth inning. We've played four and a half here in Toronto.